now is template very carefully see it's it's a new topic very important topic okay generally what is the meaning of template is a template is a template only generally where we use template means if i need a model okay bah, uh, what is that my incident dot list list okay so if i need some template kind of where some values will be predefined okay available then i can use it for my day-to-day -day job right so in service now there is a topic called template i am a service desk agent i will be closing daily minimum 50 incidents okay so when i am closing it maximum okay i will write uh, there are few fields where i will generally write like successful okay fulfilled these two i will write it okay and issue is resolved right so these are the very common selections i do for almost every of the incidents that i will close per day if it is 50 if it is 100 everyone this first this is the first point you got it yes 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 second point is so if i want to do this one okay every day i need to every time update it now i need to come here and then i need to write select this one and i need to write it this one so if i close 100 incidents today 100 into 3 300 times i need to click and then write, type it correct this is kind of little rework and i'm i'm getting frustrated here is that correct ma everyone yes correct yes yes oh, sir. so in this case how we can make it is generally we can make a simple template so i am making a template for this exact requirement okay so see here in any form that you go to service now any form this one okay or this one any form you see something called three dots do you all see three dots here it's a, yes it's not dot yes. but it's simple small circles okay maybe let's consider as a dot so three dots right now good now if, when i click this one no? if i click this one you see something coming up here here in the bottom you see something coming up so i'm clicking it very carefully see toggle template bar i'm clicking it when i click it you see something here okay so click it right so the th things that you see here is what you see here is all templates the templates that i created for incident table okay good now i'm going to create a new template so say new okay this is how you create a template okay when you say new you get the image of the form that you are currently okay loaded with i was in a form i was i am in a form okay i just give the incident uh, template name as incident resolved this is for my my thing it's not for someone okay i am giving it now okay all these values are automatically came because these are the values that this particular ticket is having it correct i created a i, I said plus here na so this record what you have okay right now if you have color equal to this one category equal to this one this one this one so you have already some values for this field right so when you say plus the template is getting generated those values will automatically come understood ma everyone understanding it so you see approval yes, this value color this value okay color description everything came correct you all seen it Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. now i don't want all of them i don't want this one i don't want this one okay because i want very few limited things i don't want even this one so i want state this is important urgency not required okay this one not required this one not required not required not required not required, not required. Resolution code successful resolution notes. This is important for me and this is not required. This is not required 
So in my template, these are the three values I would like to keep it. This is what my requirement. Correct, ma? Yes, correct. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes, sir. Ah, correct. Now, okay, I will submit it. Once I submit it, I will. This template will be generated here. So see this one. Uh, incident resolved. The template is here. The template is available. Yes, sir. Now I go to any record. I I just go to any one of the incident record. Okay, and I have the template also here. So if, if it is not there, means I can get it. Okay, so the template is not. Right now, state is equal to new. Okay, this is something different. This is something different. Okay, now I apply the template. I am applying it. I am just clicking it. When I click that, the template is applied. Means the values are available from the template are assigned to these fields. Did you all notice it? Yes. These values I didn't change. These these are changed from the template. Correct. Please acknowledge, ma. Is that correct? Yes. 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 So this is a template. Very carefully see. Now, okay. What is happening is okay. Maybe do I have something called edit template? Uh, yeah. What I will do is in this template. I will also add one extra line. What is that line? Is very carefully see this. This is for my requirement. Okay. So what is the on change field here? Mention in short, na. So where is the template? Okay. Mention. Very good. Sorry, ma. I am showing an incident form, but I am my script is in different. So you understood the template, everyone, right? Everyone understood template. Yes, sir. Ah. Now, yes, sir. Ah, very good. So see here, template concept is done. Now I will create one template here. Okay, so I will write hello SKFX. Right. So in this one, I am creating a template. Very good. Right. So let's create a template. Okay. And when I am creating it, I want the yes, short somehow. I want this particular field called okay this one, and I want it like. Okay, write notes. This is okay. Definition wise, this is not a correct definition. It's not a correct requirement, but for our practical thing, I am doing it. Maybe I want this one. I want. I don't want this one, but I will. I want this one here. Okay. Hello, hello. So this one I don't want it. This one I don't want it. Okay. So I create a template. So I will give this name as okay. Uh, template. For each template, example, right? Submit it. Good, na? Very, very, very carefully see. Okay, I am loading it, right? There is a on change client script. Okay, the client script will work when this value getting changed. Is that correct? Everyone, is that correct? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. What value I given in the template, ma? Is that same value or did I change the value for write notes? Change. I change it, na? To be make sure I want something other. Ah, okay, right. Okay, good. Now I am applying the temp. I am applying the template. If I apply the template, this value will change. If the value change, is the client script runs or not? I am applying a template. Because of this template, template apply, this particular field value will change. If the field value will change, this client script will run or not is the question. Yes. Yes, yes. it will run. Yes. Yeah, yes. It should. yes, it should run. Okay. So see here. I applied it. Okay. So the client script is running. You all see the client script is running. Yes. Everyone. You all see. Yes, sir. And now is template what the value? True. True. Earlier what the value we seen? False. False. Now you understood is template is what? Everyone yes. Yes sir. Okay. Yes. Good. So this this one ran and then is template okay. So I have one scenario. Please keep it on mute. Okay. Sir. I don't want my 
script client script on change client script should run when template is getting applied okay so when okay i need to make it run in normal cases whenever the field is getting changed in normal cases i want to make it run okay but when template value is changing is applying okay that time don't my english is very not good don't run the client script then make list template as false ha so if that is the case now what you can do is you can just take this one okay and you can add it in the list then if i run this one will it run on template loading time no everyone is this the correct everyone understanding it ma why i written like this yes sir okay so if is template time if it is true do, don't do anything that means it will not run when the template loading time is true simple okay yeah yeah everyone simple yes so now see this when i added this one now you go and then see whether when you are applying a template whether that script is running or not okay because i said is template if is template equal to two don't do anything that means this script will not run when the template is getting loaded okay so apply it i applied it the value changed okay but where is the client script did the client script ran no 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 if the client script ran you should have seen that pop pop ups correct those five pop ups you should see uh, yes understanding everyone yes yes, yes.